Private Sports reporting is ordered. Welcome to Lakeville Private Sports. I'm Sergeant No Skill and I'll be sponsoring you until you get your patrol badge. How was your trip from Himmelsdorf? Good morning, Sergeant. The trip went well. I look forward to working under you during my assignment. That's good to hear, Private. Scout tanks are a vital part of Lakeville's defense. Having eyes on the lake road prevents our enemy from firing upon our heavy tanks and allows our artillery and tank destroyers sight to attack any Reds brave enough to venture into our territory. Roger that, Sergeant. I'm unfamiliar with the area, but I'll ask the M3 Lee to show me around as soon as I pick up my equipment from the armory. Don't bother, Private. M3 Lee's a special tank. Hasn't been the same since his neck injury. Spends most of his time over at the Tier 3 tank destroyer barracks. Uh... Oh, I'm sorry to hear that, Sergeant. No worries, Private. Go pick up your gear and meet me at the cap in one hour. Roger, Sergeant. This here is one of the best positions on the lake road for a scout. Hmm, great concealment from this bush. This rock provides cover from enemy fire and a clear view of the road leading into town. Excellent observation, Private. I see someone's paying attention in scout training. Thanks for showing me around, Sergeant. This is really going to help you get that patrol badge. No problem, Private. Now if there's anything else you need at all, don't hesitate to ask. Well, there is one thing that's been weighing heavily on me lately, and since you know the area better than anyone else, I would like to respectfully request your assistance. My mother was very against my joining the tank division. She's been worried sick about my safety ever since I joined. Lakeville is so nice and peaceful, it would really ease her mind if she could visit and be shown around. You know, so she can see I'm safe with her own eyes, you know? The old joining the tank division against your mother's wishes, eh? Say no more, Private. We'll show your mother you're in good hands. Let me know when she plans on visiting and we'll show her around. Oh man, how does my pink look, Sergeant? Are my tracks polished enough? Relax, Private. You look fine. You really are freaking out about this. Sorry, Sergeant. It's just, I want my mother to really be impressed with me and the tank division. Which reminds me, she's very judgmental of people who use foul language, so if you could keep the F-bombs to minimum... Roger that, Private. We'll keep this G-rated. Sporky Poo! Mom! Oh, it's so good to see you! Your father would have come, but he claims he's still running at half power after his engine caught fire last week. I think he just wanted to stay home and watch the Wargaming League Grand Finals, though. Have you been washing behind your observation deck? Yes, Mom. Good, you know how you rust when you don't keep your viewports clean. <clears throat> this is my sponsor, Sergeant No Skill. Nice to meet you, Miss Sporks. Good morning, Sergeant No Skill. I trust you've been taking good care of my boy. Yes, ma'am. Your son has already shown traits of an exemplary scout. I assure you he's in good hands. That's good to know, Sergeant. I worry about my boy in such a tough environment. Especially after that UE-57 kept taking his lunch money in high school. Okay, I think it's time we get started on this tour, right? A tour? That's a lovely idea, dear. Alright, boys and girls. Prepare to have some major Lakeville knowledge dropped on you by old Sergeant No Skill. Let's roll out. And this is of St. Radley Walters Cathedral, site of the Great Lakeville Offensive where St. Radley Walters single-handedly destroyed nine enemy tanks and carried his division to victory. This is also where I met ELC. She didn't have much armor on the engine deck. You should have seen that ammo rack. <coughs> what a great story, Sergeant. Radley Walters was truly a brave tank. No ammo rack stories. Oh, what a delightful story, Sergeant. I wish you could see the lake road, Bob. It's gorgeous, and it's where I'm going to be standing my watches, so it's a win-win for me. Too bad it's a restricted area. Great idea, Private. Let's grab some fuel across the street and head out. It won't hurt to bend the rules a little bit. Really? Thanks, Sergeant. You're going to love this, Mom. 
So you see, Mom, most of our job as scout tanks is usually staying hidden and spotting the enemy for the other tanks to attack. We're not usually involved in the firefight ourselves. You know, Sporks, I was wrong about the army. This seems to be a very good job for you, and you seem to be well taken care of. I'm glad you've shown me that you're safe. This has really given me a peace of mind. That's great, Mom. I really felt bad for joining knowing how you felt at the time, but I just know being a scout in the U.S. Tank Division was my calling. I'm sorry, Sporks. I should have trusted you more. I'm also relieved that the sergeant is a wholesome man with the highest standard of morals and values. I'm gonna... My tracks! You little motherfucker! Whoa, did you see that, Tog Mom? Look, he's right there in town. That has got to be the biggest tank I've ever seen. I'm gonna go check on the sergeant. Stay here, I'll be right back. I'm gonna rip your balls off, chop them up into little pieces, and then feed them to your ass. You little fuck. What are you doing, Sergeant? My mother is going to have a heart attack if she hears you. I will put a round so far up your ass, you will shit heat for a week. Oh my god. Sporky Poo, what's going on, honey? Oh, nothing, Mom. I'm just uh, talking to the Sergeant here. You stay there. <laughs> There's nothing to see here. Sergeant's just feeling a little under the weather. Uh, I think, uh, yeah, I think I'm gonna go ahead and, uh, yeah, yeah. There's nothing to see here. Oh dear, are you all right, Sergeant? Sergeant's just going to take a little swim. He'll be back to base shortly. <laughs>